Hello and welcome to the news. Jack is travelling with WCPW, which means you get me, Ben, and I have a news desk, which means I am more important and professional. So, as I'm sure you're all aware at NXT TakeOver Brooklyn 3, Asuka successfully defended her NXT Women's Championship against Ember Moon. But WWE then reported that uh, she'd suffered a collarbone injury and would be out for up to three months, which made some of us think, what's she going to do with that title? She has been undefeated for 523 days! So, as part of the current tapings for NXT that will be airing in the next few weeks, she actually relinquished the NXT Women's Championship to General Manager William Regal, who brought her out and showed a nice little montage of of her just kicking people's faces in for the past year and a half or so and also then all the NXT uh, people came out on the on the ramp and applauded her and it was lovely and then Triple H came out and he shook her hand and gave her a bouquet of flowers and said look it's her the woman that kicked all the faces and even Ember Moon came out and went to shake her hand and she, she didn't shake her hand she gave her a nice hug and that's lovely which was quite interesting because obviously Asuka is playing a, uh, a heel or she was playing a heel, and this is quite a face move, but I think that probably legitimizes her injury because a lot of people probably assumed that it would be maybe a work, uh, a story going forward that she was injured and then just play it from there. But no, it seems like she's legitimately hurt and supposedly she is also in talks with the general managers of Raw and SmackDown. So when she does return, she will be going up to the main roster. Now, before Asuka did this, Paige was the only woman to have made it to the main roster undefeated as champion. Now, of course, Asuka is just undefeated in general. No one's been able to touch her since she joined NXT. But what does this mean when she makes it up to the main roster? Is she gonna be booked as a destroyer? Is she gonna go to Raw to the slightly underwhelming women's? division what do you think is gonna happen and of course what's gonna happen with NXT now are they gonna have a tournament to decide who the next women's champion is do you think it's gonna be Ember Moon what do you make of the just this state of the NXT women's division in general now that Asuka's left let us know in the comments below and don't forget to like share and subscribe I've been Ben from What Culture. this has been the news desk and thank you for watching